हेलो गाइस माय नेम इज अजय यादव एंड यू आर वाचिंग जे स्टार्टअप सो इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न दैट हाउ टू रिवर्स एन एरे सो यू आर गोइंग टू फेस दिस इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन सो मेनी टाइम्स एट योर इनिशियल लेवल्स लाइक वन टू और थ्री इयर्स ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस वेयर इंटरव्यूअर आज टू रिवर्स एन एरे बट देर इज अ ट्रिक इन इट वॉट देर इज ऑलरेडी अ इन बिल्ट मैथड अवेलेबल इन द एरे विच इज एरे डॉट रिवर्स मैथड but he already asked you by the interviewer that you do not need you do not going to use that inbuilt method you can use any other method but not that one okay so the last option which remain that is you need to iterate an array and then reverse it so we are going to see the same approach so there is a multiple approaches we are going to discuss three approaches here okay so the first approach we are going to discuss is the for loop which is mostly used by the developer at initial level of experience so in this case we are creating one for loop having an one reverse array in which we are going to put array values in a reverse order okay we are assigning the array dot length to the i so that i becomes equal to the length of an array then we are going to iterate until the i value becomes zero or less than of it okay so we are putting i greater than zero and i minus minus we subtracting the i and inside of that we are pushing the array values so inside of that we are saying that reverse array dot push method okay and the array dot length value as of now is the 10 okay because 8 is the number element and the 9th 10th is a js data so array length is 10 but the index is only up to 9 because array starting index is 0 so we are going to pass array i minus 1 inside of an array okay so i minus 1 because i value is 8 sorry array value is 10 array length value which is i and we are subtracting 1 okay now we are console dot log reverse array and we are going to print using the node app dot js i am installing a node so you can go ahead and install a node so you can see okay it not matches with our result because i put it wrong sorry my bad so we are going to put js start up first and then the js so we are getting the same response so at an initial level what does the meaning of initial level is like you are one year of experience you are a two experience that way if you give and this answer to the interview or you solve in such a way no issue interviewer is say okay okay but if you are more than that that's not going to work because the interviewer want not to you to solve the problem but you used to use the latest functionality okay so here we come use the second approach to get the same result okay in that case we are using let reverse array and we are using another method of array which is called reduce write method what is the reduce write so as we know that when we are using array dot map filter for each they are all iterating an array from left to right means from index 0 to the last index but it that not the case with the reduce right it starting iterating from the end of the array okay so it start iterating from start up to the number 1 okay so we are having a three parameters in the reduce right but we need only two which is accumulator and the el which is a current value accumulator is the initial value which we put as an array so we can put anything string number but here we need an array we have in which we can push those value okay and then we return that accumulator value so it will going to push every value in reverse order and it return to reverse order because reduce write convert your array values to a single value which is in the reverse array so you can see we console it we got the same response so the first approach is also good the second approach is also good but the first approach telling me that you solve the problem but based on your experience it say it let me know that okay but if you are three year experience four experience if you are giving the same first approach answer i am not happy with that even your interviewer also not but for the second approach i am happy and interviewer also become happy that's my thinking just because that let me know that you not only to solve the problem you use the latest functionality and the last but not the least we have the third approach which is the array dot reverse which i already told you available in the array method okay 
so these three approaches the last approach add it or reverse is you going to use at your coding level when you are working on project you are not going to use the reduce right over there because you do not need a four lines of code when you can just go ahead with the one line okay the above two approaches is used for interview purposes because that let the interviewer know that yes you can put the logic you can put the simple logic you can put the complex logic to your project so the first method is very nice for the initial level of development initial level of developer interview question okay so i'm if i you are asking by the same reverse array method one to two year experience first method is awesome but more than that the second method which is the array dot reduce okay so if you like this video please share this video to the facebook linkedin instagram where you like and make sure to subscribe my channel i'll be creating more videos like this which will help you in your interviews and your logic building until then stay tuned